Hi there. Did you ever wonder how to run your Shield TV user interface in real 4K? Wouldn't it be nice to view your photos in true 4K sharpness? It's possible. This method has been tested on a 2017 Shield TV device running the latest Shield Experience 9.0. Let me know in the comments if this method worked on other Android TV devices as well. Let's get started. Step 1, at first you need to turn on the developer options. To do so go to the entry, about, in the device preferences. Click the entry build version 7 times. After that, you will get feedback that you are a developer now. Great. Let's move on. Step 2, now that you are a developer you will find a new entry in the device preferences called developer options. Then scroll down to the chapter HDMI. Enable the option show all supported modes in custom display modes. Step 3, reboot your Shield TV. Now your user interface will be shown in true 4K. This is very useful for large screens. Check out what a difference this makes when displaying photos on your screen. Wow! Look at the leaves of the palm tree. A few things to note. While all apps now run in native 4K this will come with some drawbacks. First, the UI is not as smooth anymore. There are usually some hiccups. Also, graphically intense apps like games or screensavers will run significantly slower. I guess that's the reason why the Shield does not offer a true 4K experience except for watching videos. If you start any app that changes the resolution like NVIDIA's game stream the UI scaling will be reset to the default again. A reboot of the device will turn the UI back to 4K. Let me know in the comments about your experiences and help other users with your knowledge. Did you find issues with certain apps? Did this work for you on a different Android TV device? If you want to turn off the 4K UI again, simply uncheck the HDMI options in the developer options or turn the developer options off completely. Then reboot your device. As usual, if you liked this video, please give a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.